I am Mike Corruption and today I will be guiding you through the Defiant Map Pack achievements on Halo Reach. Now there are three achievements, they are Candy from a Baby, Cracking Skulls and Return to Sender. What you need to do is download the custom games, now obviously you can see it says Author Bungie, it has to say Author and Bungie or it won't unlock in custom games. You need two controllers, your main controller and obviously a second controller with a guest account. Make sure you're on different teams. Now I suggest for every achievement you set the map to Asylum. It's quick, it's confined, it's small, it's it's a lot easier. Right, the first achievement we're going to go for is Return to Sender. Now this involves you returning two flags of your own back to, obviously, your base. Now what you're going to do is... Wait for it to load up and right, you're going to get your guest to run over to your base, run over to the main account base and pick up the flag. As soon as he has picked up the flag, you want to drop it as soon as you pick it up and then Flags sit on it. Stolen. And then I'll go over throwing it and Rob. then you get your main account and then move on to the blue flag and obviously you know what happens next, it returns it. Flag recovered. Return one, you want to do it again, and then throw it to your main account again. You got to do this twice. Done twice, another achievement. And there we go, return to sender. End game, let's have a look. There we go, defiant return two flags in a match made CFTF game. Now obviously it's on custom, but of course this works, it's a glitch. You will not get banned, do not worry. Now the next we need cracking skulls and candy from a baby. All maps, all game types, sorry, will, you don't have to get them yourself, I will be posting links in the description box, so it's a lot easier, you just click download, log in with your Bungie account, and download it to your Rost Active downloads, and it'll get to your thing. Next we need to go to Stockpile, and go Stockpile there, it says Author Bungie, you can see the difference, one just says nothing, and the other says Bungie, it has to say Bungie, the author, or well, obviously the glitch will not work. Now for this, we are going Stockpile. for Candy from a Baby. Now this one is a slightly bit longer, it takes about 2 minutes this one, but it won't take you long. It will literally, for all three as you can see, it will take 10 minutes. So, you want to get your second controller to get two flags. So, we'll get that flag over to the left. So just jump over this uh, ledge, pick up the flag. And then run it all the way back to the base. Now obviously it's going to count down the timer and you, you don't want to waste time. So what you want to do is drop it just about here. So it's not in the red zone so it won't be captured. But obviously when the timer's gone down to zero it won't reset the flag. Then you want to get a second flag. And there we go. Pick this one up and run back to the base. And again, drop it here. Now get your main account to run over. All the way over to the guest account's base. Now, as soon as you're over there, you want to get the guest account to drop one flag, just the one, into the red zone. So the flag goes from the grey to red. There we go, it's gone red. Now you need to go in there as your main account, pick up the flag, and run it back to your base, and then put it into your capture zone. Now, I sw now is a bit of advice, do not drop the flag, do not press right trigger or switch weapon so you drop the flag, because as soon as you drop the flag it will void the achievement. Basically by that I mean it will just think it's just a regular flag and it's not a flag took from your enemy's base. Drop it in, wait for it to cap. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, it will be 1, it's a flag's collected. Flags collected. Now you want to do the same as what you've done before, get your guest account to drop it, pick up the flag and drop it in so it turns red. You then on your main account pick that flag up and then run it back to your base. Like, because if I drop this flag now and picked it up it would count as a, diff a normal flag, it wouldn't count as a flag from my enemy's like stockpile capture zone. That's why you cannot drop it. So just keep carrying it, don't mess about, drop it in. 
Now we've got an awful 20 second wait, so in these 20 seconds, simply I will post all links to the game types in the description box. So do not worry on that, I'll get them all there for you, all in order. And it's simple as that. Again, do it on Asylum, you can do it on any map, it does not matter what the map is. It can be on a Noble map, a Defiant map, a normal, regular game mode map, it doesn't matter. But Asylum is the best because it's so small, obviously. Almost captured and done. Flags That's two flags. And there's the achievement, Candy from a Baby, 75 gamer score. There we go, captured two flags from an enemy capture zone in a match made stockpile game. Now the last final achievement is Cracking Skulls and it's the last achievement I need for 100% completion of Halo Reach gamer score. So again, go to the custom game lobby as we're already in. Go to game type, go to oddball, and then oddball, which or for bungee, and then start game. Right. Now what you want to do is you want to get your main account, which one for me is blue. Get him to the school. Him or her. Run him to the school. You can get your guests to go to the school as well. Right. So you want to pick up the school. Then press the B button. Depending on obviously what account your thing it is. It could be the RB button, depending on what um, controller layout you've got. So again, find your guest. And there's mine. Hit him from the front because if you hit him from the back it can go into assassination and you don't want that. Because it will just the achievement will be longer to get. Now again, this will be the final one, this will be the third time. So run over to the guy. And bang. And there we go, cracking skulls. Unlocked. Killed three players with the oddball in a match made oddball game. And there you go, you have got all three achievements from the Defiant map pack. And that was took you less than seven minutes. You've got all the achievements in it. And you Over. did it all in custom games and you didn't have to go on to the big wide world of Bungie multiplayer. Thank you for watching and I'll post everything in the description box.